Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Dreadrun. Please give me one moment. I can't turn down the volume. It won't let me. I just read, I have to wait. Because all I got is graphic binding, key, key bindings, gamepad, and audio language. No! normal <coughs> and I will do my intro once I have uh, set up all the um... <coughs> the uh, the sounds and stuff mm -hmm. I'll just let this play out for a minute Slow down, Mr. Drippy. But Ding Dong Dell's just on the way. Huh? Hmm? Oh. Huh? What do we do? Run for it! Ah! Oh no! Ah! Game over. Get going, shall we? Huh? So this is your world. That's right. A whole nother world. Beautiful, innit? You're real beautiful. If you're talking to me, unfortunately, I'm having issues right now with the app, and I can't see. Um, so give me one moment. I had everything set up, and... Sleep, even though I'm looking straight at the goddamn camera. I don't know how to fix that. Level 5. Hooray! I did play a little bit of this a long time ago. Uh, this is, I pre bought it. It was on sale for the PC. I do really like Studio Ghibli stuff. Welcome to Motorville. <laughs> Drive save. I know the new mobile game came out. Uh, I, I will not talk about that right now. I want to play this game. Sorry, mister. Oh, I forgot. The English isn't so good in this version, I don't think. Good morning, Miss Layla. Why, good morning, Oliver. Your groceries are over there, honey. Well, thank Thanks. you, man. Oh, I almost forgot. Did Philip find you? He said he had something to show you, dear. No. Really? So he finally finished it, huh? Do you know where he is right now? He just stepped out with some deliveries for me. I doubt he'll have gotten far. Thanks, Miss Layla. Oh, say hi to your mother for me. Will do, Miss Layla. Will do. All right, I gotta. Hey, Ollie. Hey, Ollie. Over here. <laughs> Unfortunately, I have to wait. I guess until I get through some of this for the menu crap. Oh, it's Phil. Pad to walk over to where Philip is standing. Approach Philip and press the talk button and A. Okay. I don't know. Um. Yep. That's what I thought. 
How do you like my hot? She's pretty too. Maybe we'll be able to afford Cool as me, kid. They're weird. My, these potatoes are so cheap. Perhaps I'll make some nice, healthy french fries for the kids. Why, good morning, Oliver. How's your mother? I don't know you. Don't talk to me. Good thing you found me. Guess what? She's finally ready. Oh, yeah? So what Miss Layla said? Is it really what I think it is? Is it a rocket ship? What else would it be, dum-dum? Nuclear bomb, I don't know. Boy, you are something else, Phil. So what do we do now? What else? We take our first spin. Tonight. All right. What? Tonight? But I can't. I mean, I need to ask my mom. Sure, sure. You go ask your mom. And then when do we do it, huh? Tomorrow? Mm -hmm. Next year? Yeah. Well, I... No, but... Okay, we'll do it tonight. But we'll have to be real quiet. Sure we will. Sure we will. Okay, tonight in my garage. Be there or be square. I'm not square, I'm kind of round. Sure. Just making sure I'm not having any sorts of lag. It looks like I am a little bit. So, this is the child who will save the world. Mm hmm. Or oh, so says the crystal ball, your radiance. Hmm. The dark djinn's power alone will mm -hmm. not suffice. I fear not. What is the child's name? Oliver. Your radiance. Oliver. Oliver Twist. The mini map will be displayed at the right corner. Yep, yep. I got it. What you've done with the town square? I talk to my wife and the kids there a lot. It's nice to have such a wide open space right in the center of town. Hey, Ollie, I know you and Phil are up to something, but why don't you let me in on it? No! Jaywalking. How are you? I heard from my boy that Philip has been secretly working away on something. Hmm. I know it's good for you youngsters to have hobbies, but don't go causing any trouble now, you hear? No! You can't tell me what to do! My house. Hey, mom. I got the groceries. The milk's Thanks, warm Susan. now. Just pop them on the table, will you? Say, mom. Hmm? Did you say something, sweetie? No. Um, you're kind of busy tomorrow, huh? Well, now that you mention it, I do have to practice for my concert in the morning. Oh, yeah? So, you'll be in bed kind of early, huh? Mm -hmm. uh, yes, I suppose I will. Why do you ask? Oh, you will, huh? <laughs> well, you stop being so mysterious and eat your breakfast. You'll be late for school. School's for losers. Mm -hmm. Before you swallow. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh. Thanks for breakfast, Mom. Bye. See you later, Mom. Bye, sweetie. You be good now. No. I will. I'm gonna fight with all the kids. Hey, Phil. Uh, you didn't go to school yet. Heh. <laughs> school smooth. Today's a special day, kiddo. Uh, today's their day our dream machine finally rolls off the drawing board and onto the streets of Motorville. 
Oh boy, I can't wait. When can I see it? Oh, hello there, cowboy. Not so loud. Don't forget this is our secret. Hey, Dum Dum, you didn't tell your mom about it, did you? No. N no, I didn't. I asked her if she was busy, and she said she has a concert practice, so she'll be in bed really early tonight. Hey, perfect. And then tonight's the night. You still in, Kato? Sure am. Tonight at your garage. I'll be there. There's a lot of voice acting in this game. I forgot. Why am I looking down? No, I'm looking straight ahead. She must be asleep by now. Nito, she's out like a light. Now's my chance. I have to get to Phil's garage. Press Y to open the main menu. Use up, down, left, right, left, right, up, down, up, down. Yes. Yay! You can now use the main menu. Hooray! Up, oh, goddamn time. Alright. Okay, hopefully you guys aren't deaf from that. I am so, so sorry. Uh, guiding star, minimap, vibration. Nah, turn that on. Um, well, I guess we're stuck in English. Yay, we saved it. Head to Phil's garage. Maybe I don't want to head to Phil's garage. Maybe I want to explore it. Maybe there's stuff in... There's like loot and stuff in here. But I don't think there is. Oh shit, I forgot to do my intro. Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Rid Rid. Welcome to the Space Monkey and Mafia where pants are the enemy. Yes, I know, game. <coughs> we are playing Nino Kuni, the White Witch Remastered. Mm -hmm. I am a big fan of the studio Studio Ghibli. I do like his stuff. Yeah. Mom's fast asleep. Uh, this was a game I never beat, so we're going to play it. I know we're playing a lot of games right now, but I really want something pretty to look at. Um, and kind of take my mind off of things. I've been having issues with my health lately. Nothing too serious, but it sucks none the least. Oh, that's right. There's no bathroom in here, I don't think. There's no bathroom in the house. Resident Evil. Type of camera right there. I guess everybody but just poops outside. Unless the bathroom's... There's no bathroom in the house. Let's go. I know uh, I, my ADD is really bad. Do I have anything in here? No. Oh, I don't have to hold on buttons to do. Oh my god. Darn. The way Sure. What are these people doing up? What are you doing, kid? It's late. There's nobody around. But this is Motorville. I guess it'll be okay. Oh, hi. Yes, your buddy. Let's go. I can read. Hey. Awesome. What are you looking at? Yeah, no girls allowed. No goyles. What is it with that kid? What kept you, Slowpoke? <coughs> My mom just wouldn't go to bed. 
So, is it finished? Sure is. The last bearing's in, and she's primed for action. Wanna see? Do I ever? Oh yeah, what is it? Alright. Is it a motorcycle? Here goes nothing. Okay. Wow. Oh, is this me? This is so, so neat. You betcha. It's so neat. <laughs> the new Coupe Deluxe ain't got nothing on us, Ollie. It's not even close. So, you ready to hit the road, kiddo? Yeah. Hmm. <laughs> yes. Okay, there's nobody around. Maybe we should take her outside now. So, uh, Phil, who could drive first? Uh, hmm. Let me see now. I'll tell you what, kiddo. If you run down the street, down the street, make sure the coast is clear. I'll let you go first. You mean that? Oh boy! All right, I can't. I can't wait. Just wait right here. And make sure to watch out for Starry, Starry, Mar. Starry Mary? <clears throat> I wanted to say Marcy. Leah? Starry Mar Mary? You know, the girl who was spying on us before. I swear, that kid is cracked. You see that? There she is again. I bet she's a tattletale. She'll go straight to her olds. What? She wouldn't do that. What are you? Sweet on her or something? I'll go check out the front already. Sure thing, Phil. I'll be right back. No! Grand Theft Auto! Don't let nobody see it, okay? Everybody's gonna let... Everybody's gonna know I'm here. I forgot. I don't have to press B to run. All right. The coast is clear. Yay. I better go tell Phil. Don't go. What? Huh? It's that Goyle. It's bad. Please, Oliver. Don't go. Huh? Wh who are you? How do you know my name? Ollie. What's taking you so long? I'm sorry, Phil. Someone saw me. Oh, man. Who was it? Oh, uh, that girl over. Where the hell did she go? Huh? What are you talking about? What? There's nobody there. Huh? That's weird. She was right there. A girl. Yeah. A girl. A huh? girl. Mm -hmm. I bet it was that dumb, scary Mary. <laughs> oh no. Couldn't be. She's not allowed out. You must be going screwy or something. Anyway, come on. Oh, oh, uh, okay. Oliver. Oliver Twist. The boy who will save the world. Please, sir. But unfortunately, may I have some more. His light is yet a mere candle in the blackness. Mm. Indeed. He may be the child the prophecies speak of, but he is a child nonetheless. Yet these humans can be disturbingly powerful. Ooh. Did the other's darkness not engulf the land entirely? Mm. Might this one not prove equally. Tenacious. What would you have me do, your radius? Such saplings must not be suffered to grow. Oh. Very well, your radiance. He who would save this doomed world must die. Oh, she's another icky goyle. Woo. Mom, help me, I'm out of peanut butter. I ran out of toilet paper. I can't find the bathroom. Uh, sweetie? Where are you? Don't worry about it. Oliver? Ma, why don't we have a bathroom in our house like everybody else? Oliver! I love a twist. Um, you're coming. 
kind of busy tomorrow, huh? Well, now that you mention it, I do have to practice for my concert in the morning. Oh, yeah? So, you'll be in bed trying Right now, she's thinking, us? that little shit. Oliver. I see him. Just get him. All over. All over. Never hits a boy with the more. Oh, me. Her. Hell yeah. Go full Mad Max. Jeepers, creepers. I'm doing it. Uh oh. Oh shit. You got this for my kid, didn't you? I can't swim. <coughs> oh, no. Mm-hmm. Your accent keeps changing, though. I'm sorry. I swear, if I'd known, I never would have. Don't be silly, Phil. What about your car? That hunk of junk? I can make another one in no time. Well, I think you two have had quite enough excitement for one day. Yes, you Yeah, I think I might have died. Are you okay, Phil? I just twisted my ankle back there. Whatever will you uh, children get up to uh, next? Uh, huh? Uh, Allie! Allie! Uh, Allie? Oh, Mom? What's wrong? Oh. Oh, my. Mom? Gee, I did have a weak heart. Mom? Here. I'll fetch the doctor. Mom! You're sad. Oliver, sweetie. Oh, sweetie. Mom! You'll be okay. I know you will. Sacrificing herself to save her child. And yet, thanks to her, the boy lives. Of course. But shorn of his mother's love, to whom can he now turn for guidance? And soon he will come to our world, where our powers are strongest. Very good, your radiance. Hmm. Let us see how this story unfolds. I'm sure the ending will be. Engaging. What do you mean? I don't like her. Oliver must leave it.
just like now, my stream is you'll just have live. to wait until dinner Timmy oh. told her oh, he's been in there three whole days now Oliver mommy starts her new job today she's asked someone very special to take care of you mom spent a long time in I'm sure he'll look after you very well. <laughs> Be good while Mommy's away, okay? Mommy! Is something wrong, sweetie? Sex, soon, okay? Of course, sweetie. We'll always be together, Oliver. Always. Always, Oliver. I don't know, I'm tripping you balls. You just witnessed the rebirth of Drippy, Lord High, uh, Lord of the Fairies. Um, who? What, are you deaf or something? Yep. Drippy, Lord High, Lord of the Fairies, I said, didn't I? Drippy. Drippy. That's right, and I'm sick to the teeth of you a sniveling and moaning. A proper crybaby bunt in you are. Three days, man. Hey! I mean, I've been sad before, but crying for three old days, I'm surprised there's a drop of water left in you. You're a big boy, man. Three days is, where well, it's a new dog. What? I... Uh, That's mine. You're a bit flummoxed, a wee bit lost for words. Not to worry, man. I got all the answers. Oh, but uh, prepare yourself. Explaining all this is going to take a while. Ready? Uh huh. Tidy. I like your style. Very honest, anyway. Stay that way, okay? Take you far, I will. Okay. On with the show. Uh Okay. See, it's like this, see? What it is, is there's more worlds out there than this one by Earth. There's what you might call parallel worlds, see? They look by the side of you. And one of those worlds is my world. That's right, a whole nother world. Another world? That's quick you are. Which and I, that is the Lord High Lord of the Fairies. The reason I'm by Earth in this world of yours yeah, is because there's a proper bad apple trying to upset the peace of both our worlds, see? Shada, the dark jinn, his name is, and what he did was he took over people's hearts and spread war and ruin all over our world. Tried to stand up to him, I did, and he turned me into a flipping doll and kicked me out of our world and into you as the rotter. <laughs> uh -huh. And then you went and tried all over me, and poof, the curse was lifted just like that. Which makes me think you must be the one we fairies call the pure hearted one. The one that led to the world. Goes to show you can't judge a book by its cover, eh? So, anyway, that means I'd better get you over to our world and have you get rid of Shadar for us. All right with you? Me? Maybe. But how can I? Don't fret, man. It's a big responsibility, I know. Well, you'll be all right, especially with me to help you. But I. Oh, want me to ask properly, do you, Fedus? What? Oh, pure hearted one, will you please come and save our world? Hell no. I. Um, no. <laughs> yeah. Sorry, I must have misheard you. What did you say? Go on once more, but louder. No. I won't do it. Oh, no, no. I, I mean, you're weird. I can't do it. This is why they say never work with children. I ask nicely, and you give me a hearty yes, sir. That's how this works, see? Gee whiz, that would be swell, you say. It's just how these things are done. It's tradition. How am I supposed to work with this? It's like he's never read a story in his life. But I don't know anything about your world. Yeah. And I just can't right now. What? Because you and Mom dropped dead? No. Oh. Uh, yeah. You got a photo of her? Uh. Hurry up, will you? I am. Uh, okay. Let's see. Blimey. Can't be. But then you have no coincidence, neither. What is it? The Grisly Jalicia. We might just be a sick of man. What are you talking about? 
Some people in your world are connected, which means people from over by you have another version of themselves over by there, called a soulmate, see? And people with soulmates can connect mm. Well, she shared a soul with the great sage Alicia, a proper talent she was. Huh? So my mom was a sage? How does that help us save her? Well, Alicia tried the dark gin. His power was too much for her, and he trapped her in this dark jewel called the soul. When that happened, between hers and you, you might be cut off. But if you could free Alicia, it just might fix the link. And who knows, it might even bring your man back. Is that really true? I can't be sure now, but it's possible, yeah. Wait. How do you know all this, Mr. Drivy? You've been a Yeah, how do you know all this? It's ah, weird, man. There's clever of you. Good Lad. It's like this, see? I'm not the only fairy. Even though I was stuck by you, my buddies were keeping me abreast of all the goings on over there. How? I suppose it's what you might call telepathy. And that's not all. I send my lordly orders back over there, too. Having them spy on Shaddaa and that, you know, Ooh. tiny, huh? Hmm? What is it? I'll... I'll do it. I'll come to your world. I'll come with you and save my mom. Oh, that's marvelous! Yay! You for all the wrong reasons, but if it saves our world, I won't look a gift horse in the mouth. Tidy, we better get going then. Chop, chop! Okay. Okay, okay. But how do we get to your world? Oh, curious, are we? All right, I'll tell you. First thing we need is a drop of magic. Go and have a dig around in the fireplace. There's something hidden there so nosy parkers won't find it. But why would anybody hide something in there? That's for me to know and you to find out. Look lively. <laughs> All right, you have a weird nose ring, man. Uh, proper joy I could get waking up and having to do a huge, great, long explanation like that. It's a lot to ask of a fairy, even one as amazing as me. I'm not going to give him that voice because I can't do that guy's voice. Wow! Oh, can I actually go in here now? There's no bathroom in here. Hmm. Gimme, give gimme, give gimme, give gimme give loot. What could be hidden in a place like this? A mighty spell book! Huh? A book? But it will burn in there. Not this book. The wizard's companion laughs in the face of fire. <coughs> Wouldn't be much of a spell book if it didn't, now, would it? Really? Aha, gotcha. <coughs> exactly. This is a spell book? <clears throat> that there is the wizard's companion. The fountain of all wizarding knowledge. The wizard's companion. You contain the wizard. It's basically a giant. Now listen up, I'm going to teach you what's what in that wizard's companion of yours. If you have to read it, press Y to open the main menu. You should see it down at the bottom right there, and then you need to choose it with A. You can leaf through the wizard's companion at your heart's content. Take a minute or two to skim a few pages, eh? You look like a smart lad, or so I'm sure you'll soon to get into it. I almost forgot, the first thing you have to do when you get your hands on a wizard's companion is to make a pledge. You need to vow that you can, you will do all you can to be worthy of being a wizard. Right, Harry, you're a wizard. Don't look so flippin' worried. It's not all that hard. All you have to do is write down your name in the book with an open, honest heart. And you don't even have to write Oliver if you don't want it. You can write Bunty, Crybaby, or whatever you like. The more important thing is that you mean it. Go on, scribble your name down. Oh, man. Um, Fred. Are 
Are you happy with the name Dread? Yes. Well, you have taken the wizard's pledge, and you are now privy to the timeless wisdom of the wizard's companion. Yay! Right, right. right. magic in our way over to my world, is it? Hmm, now let's see. What is it? You got a wand somewhere by here? We can't go casting spells without a wand now, can we? Yeah, we can. A wand? Why would we have a wand? Oh, that's a pain. Ah, well, can't be helped. We just have to look for one outside. Huh? We won't find one out there either. Don't nitpick, crybaby bunting. Bunting? My name is Oliver. Oliver. Uh, sure. The crybaby bit was right, at least, was it? Uh. Kick him. I'd punt him. <laughs> Righto. Time to find ourselves a magic wand. You mean there's one hidden somewhere around here? Like the spell book? Ha! <laughs> You're having a laugh if you think I'm going to make it that easy, man. What do you think I am? Made of wizarding equipment? Oh, yeah. No. This is going to be a little bit more difficult, but our journey over to my world is a hunt for the soul snare, among other things. Eh, so why don't you treat this as a warm-up? The Easter egg hunt before the wild goose chase, if you will. The huh? Oh, okay, I guess. <laughs> okay, I'm lying. The thing is, I never brought a wand with me. I mean, look at me. The price of my lovability is small stature. I've just managed to carry that book, man. Oh, I don't so fairy tales lies huh us fairies are incredible liars anyway no point in carrying over spilled milk let's go find ourselves a substitute shall we a substitute how can there be a substitute for a magic wand well if you can find something brown and sticky eh, like maybe a stick we might just muddle through okay you're sure a stick will work do you think I'm sending you up the garden path or something? Fine. I'll give you a hand, Bunting. What do you think, Olive? What do you think, Olive and dear? It looks like a whole lot better now that I've cleared up the leaves and branches. Hmm? Why, there isn't so much as a twig left. It's spotless. Uh, yes, ma'am. Thank you for doing that. Oh, you don't need to thank me, dear. It's my pleasure. Eh? What are you looking at? Don't tell me you're thinking of using the lamppost as a flipping wand. We can't cut that out. Oh, you can cut that out for a start. It'll be flipping too big. We need a stick or something... That ain't it. What? Or something like that ain't it. Huh? Why don't you go over there and have a look? Okay. This is one of those proper tidy motor, eh? I might get one of them myself one of these. <laughs> I'm sorry, uh, there's no really time, is it? Uh, there's nothing wand-like over here, either. Let's go look over by the other side, shall we? Uh, okay. Oh, and when you find something, don't forget to pop it in your bag for safekeeping. Yep, look at the main menu. Bottomless bag. Yep. Yay, I now have access to the bottomless bag. It's like a bag of holding, but better. <laughs> Oliver's clothes, a familiar ticket that we changed. Fairy suit. Back soon, I'll be making these start on supper. The adults here in Mortarville are all fine, upstanding citizens, which means you'll grow into a fine, upstanding citizen, too. Your mother can be sure of that, wherever she is now. Shop, stick man.
<coughs> no, no. It's no use. There's nothing around here that looks like a wand. You're not wrong, Bunty. All right, we better split up then. Brad and the search alike. You'll go take another quick look around your house, and you stay by here and head up the outside search, okay? Okay. Yes. Okay. Big, brown, sticky. Brown and sticky. Oliver. Huh? Oh, it's you. You're, you're the little girl I met before. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. We met before. So, how do you know who I am? I'm really, really sorry, Oliver. Huh? Your mummy. I'm sorry. I couldn't save her. Oh, shit. Oh, I don't... Why would you be sorry for that? I wanted to save her. I really did. Huh? Hey, wait. Where are you... Going. Hey, where did you go? Ollie boy, why are you talking to thin air? Mr. Drippy, she disappeared again. Huh? Who did? That strange girl. That's the second time she tried to talk to me. What's that? A girl? Where? You're right about strange. I can't see her any flipping where. <laughs> well, how could you? She disappeared into thin air. Well, anyway, there's something I want to ask you. There is? Sure, go ahead. Do you mind it? You know, having a sidekick, like. Huh? A sidekick? <laughs> what? Who do you mean? Crikey, that's cold. Who do you mean, he says? Why not stab me in the heart while you're at it? I mean me! I want <coughs> to know if it was all right me joining you on your adventures. Or if you were maybe wanting to trade me in for a younger, prettier model. But it looks like I got my answer, huh? Well, so you know, if you don't have faith in people, you'll never see their true worth. And what's more? Look at this. <laughs> huh? It was on the ground. Right where that girl hmm. was standing. Chuck it here, then. Top. Well, I'll be a monkey's uncle. It's a wand. Good, your monkey's uncle. Yeah? Hmm. A real wand? Come over by here and take a look, man. It might seem like any old stick, but it's got all magic right in on it, see? It does, huh? Wow. Is that how people ride in your world? The runes are all faded, so it might have lost a bit of power. But, for our current purposes, it's a beauty. Ooh. Neato. What a stroke of luck. Luckier than you know, Ollie boy. Phew, I never thought we'd actually find one. Do you think maybe that girl brought it here for me? Yeah. She gave you free loot. A red an old stick. Yay! Right. Now we need a place to cast our spell. To cast Gateway, you need somewhere proper massive. You need space to give it oomph, see? Do we really need that much oomph? Yeah, what kind of question is that? Magic is special, innit? It's sacred. Yeah. Right? You have to cast spells in the best environment possible. No, so like I can't do it in a dumpster? Oh, man. You really are new to this, aren't you? This is beginner stuff we're talking about here. Oh, uh, sorry. sorry. Now, take me somewhere with plenty of space. It's got to be somewhere. Um, the town square, I guess. Let's go. Autoport store. Workshop. Can I? I actually have never went over this play way before. I don't think. Dog. Rubber. His name's Genghis. Like, oh no.
I'm exploring. Bye, dog. Auto repair. Well, it's been so great how the city folk live, pup. But it's kind of getting, it's gotten late. Time sure does fly when you're having fun. It sure does, son. Maybe it's a little too late to drive all the way home. I guess we better see if there's a motel around here, huh? Ooh, burgers and malt. Alright. We'll cut around. Do, 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 do. There's got to be like a sprint button besides this. I thought there was. Come on, faster. Ah! Ah! Grand Theft Auto, let me in, let me in. Should be doing this here? No worries, man. Normal people can't see magic, see? Go on, Ollie boy. Cast gateway. Um. Uh oh. I don't know how to read. Gateway. <laughs> no, no. It's an upside down ultramarine symbol. Punch you, man. This is your world. Ah, home at last. But there's a tidy way to go yet. Hey, Mr. Drippy, that was pretty neat just now, huh? Oh, that herd of elk. Enjoy your first encounter with the majestic wildlife of our mysterious world, did you? Uh-huh. Huh? Jeepers. Oh, Nickers, where did he spring from? Uh, ah, what do we do? He's not like the big softies just now. He's in gym for a fight. Proper savage. Let's run away. No, use that stick you got by there. Give him a whacking and send him packing. Huh? Huh? Ah! I don't know how to do this. Lately, he's making his move. Oh, no. Come on. It's 8 deck. And don't fret, Ollie boy. Let your old pal Drippy talk you to the basics of battle. First of all, look at that green gauge by there. That shows you your health. Yay, the more healthy you are, the healthier you are. Got it. And blue is magic. Don't worry, man. Let's... Ruffy. 
You can see this information above them. Okay. Red Gate shows you their HP. You get that down to nothing, and you've won. And these speech bubbles down there are your commands in battle. Yes, no, no. Oh, yes. Bob's your uncle. Tidy. Should I say nice? Uh, that's when you say when you find an enemy's weak spot or block a big attack, you see. Oh, look! It dropped something! Um, now that you know... That's what's known as a glim, Ollie boy. Enemies drop them in the heat of battle. Green glims like that one. Uh, yep, restore your health. Blue ones give back your mana. Same color C and K. Got him. Well, hey, proper tidy. Nice one, aren't yeah. you? Jeepers, creepers. Oh, yeah, I forgot to mention. Our world is absolutely riddled with beasties. But keep that up, and you'll have nothing to worry about. Right, let's go. Oh, no. We... Sure, Mr. Drippy. But where are we going? Well, first off, we need to get you a wand. But I already have a wand. You're having a laugh, aren't you? That thing's about as magical as a flipping cabbage. You might just squeeze a gateway spell out of it, but who can forget about anything more than that? <laughs> Honestly, I wish you'd think before you open it. <coughs> oh, sorry. No, I told you ding dong. Ding dong. Didn't I? Well, if we're very lucky, we might find a wand with a bit more oomph down by there. So. Are wands really so hard to find here? Well, time was you couldn't move for the flipping things. But since Shadar showed up, magic's taken a real nosedive. He banned people from using it, see? Cursed anyone who tried to. He scared them all so much they gave it up. No, no. So, he's pretty scary, huh? <laughs> well, he turned me into a flipping doll, didn't he? Just saying his name's enough to make most folks prick it. <laughs> I'd rather be a doll than have him go poking round in my heart. No one wants to be broken hearted. Broken hearted? Like, sad? But worse. worse than that, much worse. It's when he steals a piece of a person's heart. Poor beggars don't know whether they're alive or dead. That's no way to live, man. So that's why they're all so scared of him, huh? Let we can't let him go on doing this. Broken it's not a matter of letting him, is it? It's not like people flipping enjoy it. That's why I brought you here, innit? You might just be able to stop him, see? <laughs> you really think I can? Of course you can! You are the pure hearted one! And the legends say that the pure hearted one will drive away the darkness. Yeah! You a few tasty spells and you'll be ready to face him in no time. Sound good to you? Okay, I'll do it. I'll learn magic. Of course you will, and that's why we need to find you a better wand. <laughs> All right, let's head for Ding Dong Dell. Ding Dong Dell. Mm, yeah. Out of this world. Yay! Hey, it's Beauty Olive Boy. Ah, oh, it's good to be back. Outer world is aptly riddled with monsters. If one of them spots you, and you see a big question mark pop over its head. It'll charge when it gets within touch and distance. You'll have a fight on your hands. If you run out of HP in a battle, you'll be out for the count. So be careful in it. Oh, and there's a tiny technique for you. If you can sneak up behind the monster without them noticing, you can get the first hit in, giving you the upper hand. The only thing, it only works the other it works the other way around too. If the monster sneaks up, yep. Oh yeah, and here's a little something considered a gift from the High Lord of the Fairies. You turn three throws, yay! Uh, thanks, but what do I do with these? Just have a munch on them when you're feeling a bit ropey, and you'll be right as rain, man. But a wizard cannot live on bread alone, Ollie boy. He needs a proper wand and all, and that knobby thing in your hand is doing me my flippin' head in. See that big castle to the north? That's Ding Dong Dell, that is. I reckon we'll find ourselves a wand by there, so let's get moving, shall we? Okay. 
He obtained a bunch of something. Oh. A sleepy fowl. Got him. <sighs> do, 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 do. Oh. Another sweet pea fowl. Watch this. Never got. Attack is auto win this game. Is there a way to like zoom in? to save. We're going to do a little bit of grinding. Let's do it. Miss. Nice. Level two. Watch this. Yeah. I like the combat in is it the second one. The second one, maybe I played a bit of that. We can do this. Ow. Yeah, you eat it. Let's try to fight whatever this thing is. It's a rough roof. Watch this. Yeah. Got him. Yeah, it was the second game. Yeah. Come with this different in second game. Before the army stuff. I don't think I can fight that big stompy thing over there, so I'm not gonna try. No, Nickers. There's something I forgot to tell you. What's that, Mr. Trippy? Here in the world, you can change your viewpoint. If you're having trouble with the controls, go to the settings and you're okay. Yep. I guess. Alright, we learned about how to turn on vibration and how to change the world menu. <laughs> Not really world menu, but zoom around.
What kind of weapon Looks is that? To me like a classic case of broken heartedness. Uh oh. Broken heartedness? You mean that thing you were talking about before? That's right. The broken hearted are people who've had part of their hearts stolen. Poor souls just uh, aren't themselves. Go all weird and uh, useless they do. So his heart was broken uh, by. Keep up, will you? Shadar, in it. If anyone tries to stand up to him or does anything he doesn't like, he breaks their hearts into pieces so they can't put up a fight. Jeepers. Jeepers, but creepers, if mister. If he stays that way, we can't get into Ding Dong Dell. Then you better cure it, mate. Ollie boy, it's time to mend your first broken heart. Mend it? But how do I do that? Well, you can't just do it yet. There's a couple of things you need first. But I know an old man who's got what you need. Proper useful, am I, eh? An old man? What old man? What do you mean, what old man? The old man, ain't it? Lives in a woods to the north of here. Proper deep. And deeply dark it is. That's why they call it the deep dark wood. Makes sense, I guess. Mama, I need... I'm not going to read that. Oh dear, I hope they let us in soon. I need to buy ingredients for my husband's favorite dinner. This is a disgrace. I've been here for hours. And why are they... When are they going to just let people in? <clears throat> I swear that girl over there keeps looking at me. I hope they keep her... They keep us out here a little longer. What? They've got to let us in. Mother will, will go spar if I'm late again. Hey, what's going on here? They can't keep us waiting like this. Well, it doesn't look like any of us are going anywhere in the near future. I don't know what happened to his voice. Uh. One, two, three, four. You want to enter town, do you? Well, I'm afraid that's impossible. It's my colleague, you see. He's the one in charge of letting in, but recently he's just refusing to do it. He says he can't be bothered. <clears throat> Perhaps I'll buy some bread. This is one of the weird NPCs. Oh. Ha! Minor boyard. Ow! That minor boy kicked my butt. Whoa! -oh. Level up. Am I going? Okay. I'll just save real quick. <coughs> Shit. I was ambushed. things hurt watch this huh. 
Nice. Woo. Shit, 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 shit. I think he might get an attack on me. I don't know. We can do this. Oh man, spooky doopy. Where is this place? Let's do it. Skulls for the skull through. <laughs> Where am I going? So over this way, I guess. Let's do it. Let's do it. Poison be gone. Yay, the dark, dark, deep, dark, dark, dank wood. The deep, dark forest of fairy tales. Spoopy. Look at that. Waystone. Useful. Yeah. Stones. You can use them to your adventure so far. And while you're and so on, you can't just plock yourself down on the nearest ro rock and write your down your story. But why not? Why not, he says. Give me strength, man. Because they're crawling with horrible beasties, ain't it? They are? That sounds kind of scary. You'll get used to it, man. Just remember... You can't record your progress anywhere. <clears throat> Allow me to explain. I'm not reading this because it's it's common knowledge, and you can uh, you know get the gist yourself. It's a safe spot. <clears throat> we should be at every stop at Waystone, you see, and make good use of it. Better safe than sorry, eh? Sure, Mister Tippy. Tiddy. That's what I'd like to hear. Let's hope you're as good as you're, you are in your world. Righto. Next stop, the old man of the woods. Yep. Look at that. Alright. I think that is good for now. Um, thank you for watching the stream hopefully the audio and everything was okay <coughs> hopefully it didn't blow out your eardrums in the beginning i'm sorry about that <coughs> i will be playing more of this i will be playing more of chrono cross and things like that i'm just trying to spice up my content right now um over on youtube by posting different things that and i have an issue with my add where I will see something I really want to play, and I'll, I'll play that for a bit and completely forget what I was doing. I'm trying not to do that, so I'm trying to keep Chrono Cross going. I'm trying to keep, and maybe this game going. Um, sorry, my thoughts are a bit jumbled today, but thank you, ladies and gentlemen, for joining me. I had a really fun today. I know there was a lot of story and exposition, but we'll get into more gameplay and stuff tomorrow, or maybe not. maybe not tomorrow. I don't know. Uh, depends on how well I do after work. Uh, 
it's been a rough ride. Uh, I, I just can't seem to catch a break right now with my health. Um, I had a severe asthma flare-up that knocked me on my ass, and I'm still kind of on my ass about it. And today, for unknown reasons, I broke out in hives at work. I don't know if it was something I touched. I don't know if it was from construction dust or something, but it was very bad. Uh, my hands turned bright red, and it looked like I had chicken pox or bug bites all down my arm. Um, it was no good. It was no good. Um, some other stuff I want to talk to about, but I don't think I'm going to be doing that in the stream. I think right now is a good place to stop it. Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Dreadbread. Thank you so much for stopping on by. If you liked what you saw here, please hit that follow button. And if you're seeing this on YouTube and you like what you saw, hit that subscribe button. If you're wondering why I'm playing this again, I think I do have a small play of, playlist of this up. I'm, I'm not sure. I think I do. Um, it's because I wanted to play this game again and actually get farther in it and beat it. Uh, Nino, Nino, New, oh, however you say the game, Nino Cooney Cross Worlds came out, which I'm not going to be playing. Um... It is a mobile game, or a mobile game that they just released the PC part of it today to the US. It has a lot of positive reviews, however, uh, it has been leaked that if you look in their Discord thing, they tell you to join, they tell you basically to give the game a, a positive review and you will get free stuff for it. So there's lots and lots and lots of positive reviews for it right now basically as an incentive to get free stuff in the game um the game itself has from what i've seen and what i've read has a ridiculous amount of microtransactions in it they want to put nfts in it they want to put um whatever that micro block chain shit is in it and it just it's sad because it looks very pretty it looks like you know ghibli genshin impact but unfortunately, it's it's a uh, microtransaction machine that autoplays itself. Uh, there is a way to turn off autoplay to a certain degree, but it always turns itself back on. So you're basically letting the game play itself while you're pumping money for that dopamine hit. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, my name is Tribrin, and I will see you on the next one next time. Bye.